Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Well, my name is Luisa. I'm Mexican and uh, this is my second video. I'm doing a get to know me. So yeah, I, well, I have a beautiful baby boy. He's three now. He is so beautiful. He is my biggest blessing and I love him with all my heart. Uh, well, I'm Mexican. Um, I'm 19 years old. And yeah, okay, well, let's speak about my life. Well, at fifth, okay, at 15, I found out I was pregnant. Yes, I found out I was pregnant because I was really sick. Like, I was my stomach was hurting a lot, and I kept throwing up and throwing up. So, we went to the hospital, and um, I found out I was pregnant. So, yeah, I was 15 and pregnant. Uh, was I did I was I scared? Yes, I was scared when I went to the hospital. Thank God the doctor was so nice. He gave me the chance to be able to tell my mom. So we went to the hospital like around 10. It was, it was in the night. We came to the, we went to the hospital. And obviously my boyfriend came with me because he had dropped me off at my mom's house. And then he's like, I think we need to take her to the hospital because like she keeps being sick through her stomach. And that's what happened. So yeah, they took me to the hospital. And uh, well, give me a minute. But yeah, like I was saying, uh, so he took me to the so they took me to the hospital, and then she had to get her eye checks. She had something happened to her eyes. So we both went to the emergency room at the same time. You know what I mean? Hit mama. Give okay, me a kiss. No, I broke one. Okay. Hey, shark. But yeah, so. Um, she, we both, when we got called in, we both got called in at the same time, but it was with different doctors. So yeah, they took me, they took a pregnancy test, and yeah, they told me and my boyfriend that I was pregnant. Was I scared? Yes. What did I think when, well, when I found out I was pregnant, when they told me I was pregnant, I was just like, like, what? Like, are you serious? Uh, it, was, it was just something, I was happy, because at the end of the day, a baby's a blessing, so. I was happy, but I was so scared. I was like, oh my God, my mom's gonna beat me up. Like, they're both gonna hit me, because I got two moms, so like, they're both gonna hit me. Like, oh my God. So yeah, that happened, um, but I was scared. But then, um, I, I wasn't, I, I didn't want to tell her. I was like, let me just, I told my boyfriend, like, let's just tell her when I start showing, and I'm gonna be like, oh, I'm pregnant, yay. But he was like, no. So the next day, he stayed over that night. He told her if he could stay over the night. Obviously in different, like, I had to go to my room, and he had to be in the couch, but we ended up being in the couch together. <laughs> But, um, uh, he's like, can I spend the night here, like, to watch over her? And my mom was like, yeah, because she was always, like, she was very trustworthy because she, obviously, she didn't let me stay with him by myself. She used to always be there. So she was like, yeah. And then the night I was like, no, let's tell her until I start showing, you know. And then he was like, no. And in the morning when we woke up, uh, no, that night they went to buy me some juice and stuff. My mom was like, so what's wrong with you? I was like, oh no, it's just a stomach virus, this and the third. She was just like, she looked at me and she was like, why do you have to take prenatal vitamins? I was like, oh, because you know I need vitamins, this and the third. Happy birthday, woo! It was your birthday. Oh. But yeah, um. Happy birthday to you. I love you. But like I was saying, yeah, that's my baby, I'm sorry. But, um. So I was like, let's tell her, I already said that part, whatever. So the next morning I was just like, you have to leave, like, like, let's not tell her, like, I'm not ready to tell her yet. And then he was like, no, I'm telling her, I was like, no, you're not, like, that's my decision. And he was like, no, it's not, it's both of our decisions. So he starts walking up the stairs to tell my mom, so I'm just like, oh my God, I couldn't even stop him. So he was like, hey, can we speak to you? He went to her room and like, can I speak to you with something important about Luis and me? So we go to the couch, and I sit down on the couch, and I'm just like, my heart is skipping to be like, I, I was so scared. Like, so scared. So then he was like, we had to tell you something. And I was like, you're the one tell her. Like, you're the one that called her down on me. So we start telling her, and then we tell her that I'm pregnant. And she starts crying. I start crying. I was like, I, I'm crying. I was like, I'm pregnant. I'm sorry. I don't want you to hit me. But I'm not going to give up my baby. I want my baby. I'm not going to give him up. This is the third. And then she's like, nobody told you to give him up, dumbass. <laughs> it's like, I want you to have your baby. And she was just, like, emotional because I was very young. So she was just emotional. And then, uh, yeah, and then uh, I called my other mom up. And um, she starts snapping and talking about she's never going to speak to me again because she, I never told her early. She thought I lied to her. She thought I never told. I had just found out the night before, so she thought I always kept it away from her. But then she, like, 
an hour later she comes and then she holds me and then she said we're gonna and they both are there for me they said we're gonna get through it like I was like get through what I'm just pregnant I'm not dying <laughs> of course I'm gonna get through it and then yeah that's how I was so when uh so yeah that's how I was so then obviously but I had him at 16 because a month after my birthday he was my present he came out of me but yeah but yeah I'm Mexican um what else can I say about me? I'm just blessed. Like, I don't have the, I don't care about material stuff, to be honest. I have my beautiful baby, and he is healthy. He is so big now. Like, big, big, big. Like, it's crazy how big he is. But, yeah, he's gotten very big. And he was always a big baby. He weighed 8 pounds, 5 ounces when he was born. About to be 8 pounds, 6 ounces when he was born. He was born at 539. But that's a whole different story. I'm going to tell you my delivery because it was hectic. My delivery was hectic but yeah that's just me this is me i have a beautiful three-year-old uh did i get like hated on because for being a, a, a teen mom well not really nobody ever told me anything i mean they never really cared i guess i mean my mom no they never they didn't they really didn't tell me bad things like nobody ever judged me when finding out i was pregnant i was going to this high school and i decided to go to this pregnancy high school I was only a pregnant girl, so I met a lot of girls there. So I was, I was, I was never really bullied. Because, I was actually never bullied because we were all pregnant. That school, uh, yeah, that school was really good. They taught us a lot about our babies, about our bodies. You know, I'm just like, I was just like, oh, I just want to see him already. But yeah, um, but yeah. Obviously, I graduated high school when I was 18. I'm 19 now, and. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, and what else can I say? No, that's all I can say because, well, yeah. So, yes, I'm still with his baby. I'm still with my boyfriend, his father. We've still been together for five years. Yep, that's a lot. Uh, but it's all worth it. And uh, I don't care if you guys leave bad comments for me. Being so young with a child, I don't care. I don't care. I wouldn't change him up for anything. I wouldn't change him up for nothing. For nothing. Like, I wouldn't. I love him with every piece of me. Like, my whole soul. I will go through everything. I will go through everything to have him every day with me. And, I don't know, I just, like, I feel like as a mother, you're scared of losing your baby. Because, like, that is just, like, that's your baby. <laughs> and, um, well, God bless them. God bless me with him because... I feel like I'm so blessed to have him. And every morning, I'm just like, oh, I'm so scared. I overthink things. I don't want nothing bad to happen to him. But, yeah, he's my baby, and I love him with all my heart. I will do anything for him. I would just love him so much. He's so beautiful. But, yeah. But, yeah, so, yeah, that's my story. I'm actually going to do... Okay, so why did I make this channel? Well... Because I wanted to. I've been trying to make it for two years, but I'm, like, terrified. But I, today I woke up, oh, actually, the day that I posted the first video, I was just like, let me start with that. And then today I decided that I had to do it. I don't want to leave this world without doing something, without regretting it. I want to do what I want to do. If it doesn't work out, that's okay. But as long as I know that I did it, that's what matters. And I looked at my son, and he is so brave. And I decided, like, he is brave. Why can't I be brave? Like, I can do it. <laughs> but, yeah, um... My labor and delivery story, that's going to be a whole other thing. And, um, yeah, so right here in this channel, you're going to find about loving yourself, about loving your kid children, because in this world that we live in, yeah. these mothers, they look like they don't love their kids. I'm not trying to be rude. Uh, finding inner peace, uh, baby holes, obviously my holes. Uh, what else? You know, whatever you guys want to hear, challenges, anything you guys want to want to watch this comment down below and i just want to say thank you so much for watching please subscribe and like my video and uh what's it yeah. called yeah my next video will be up probably in next week or this week it depends if i even get any if i get a comment saying please put your next video up which is going to be a haul which is going to be a baby clothes haul because obviously i have a toddler so i'll do that one and then i'll do my haul but if i get a video uh suggesting that one then i will definitely make it um but yeah, thank you so much. Uh, yeah, this is my channel and uh, bye.